What's up, y'all? What is this? Dialed motion? Who the fuck is that? Yo, daddy. They a new company out of California. Been designing this system for a while now. But we're gonna go through all these components and see how they stack up against what I was going to do for a DIY. Why DIY when you can have fly? Fly girl, a fly girl, fly girl. Hey, what's up guys, it's been a while. Wish it was longer. I'm still gonna come back with some videos. Just been out doing my thing. Lots of work, lots of overtime. So I can pay for all the debt that I got from my home gym in the past. Amongst other things, like getting a new house. So I have my priority straight on that mission. But today I'm gonna go over Dialed Motion, a new cable system that I purchased a, a couple months ago that just now got to my house. I was order number seven because I was very excited about getting it. But in the process before discovering Dialed Motion, I, uh, I was doing my own DIY. I bought me some three and a half inch um, steel here to go over my three by three uprights. I got me a, a a drill press, I drilled out these holes so it can match and I could pop a pin in it. And then I bought these from Inspire Fitness, some extra, extra things that I was going to put to attach this to and slide it up and down my pole. A very small pole. But now I got the dialed motion, y'all. So I'm West Coast motion, dial motion. Yes, the potion is all over me like lotion. I'm West Coasting, boasting, and bragging. Fuck the shit. I ain't no. Uh. I'm gonna go over an unboxing of my dialed motion sidewinder. I got two of these, but I'm only gonna open up one so you can see how it looks, how it feels. Well, you can't see how it feels because you're not here, motherfucker. But I could tell you how it feels. And if you want to, I could tell you if there's a girl out there that you want me to feel for you and give you a report. That's next on MC Titan's list. Feeling your lady. Motherfucker, ain't no ladies feeling you. So the difference between these, this hole in casing is much larger than what I was going to do when I was going to do my DIY and stick these together. We're gonna go over that and then some, because that's who I am, motherfucking MC Titan. Biatch! You got that, but biatch? the packaging is very nice, I must say. Now we're gonna go over the weights of my different material. As you can see, my DIY sleeve Weighs 1.6 pounds. Now the what what what? Oh, the Inspire Fitness added onto it is four pounds. Added onto that, which would have been the handle, is my surplus strength. Going at 5.8 pounds. Now let's see what the dial motion's got for you. Because I know that's what you want to know. Because the dialed motion is actually a lot larger, but relatively the same weight. They give you these very nice handles, I must say. That's because they hooked you up in this first pre-order. And the compact pulley swivel. Swivel pulley? I don't know what you call it. But all I know, it's relatively around the same weight. So what am I really trying to demonstrate? That they weigh the same? Nobody gives a fuck that they weigh the same. But I'm going to give you everything you never wanted to see before in a video. And that's weighing this shit out. When you really want to know what it's used for. And how to use it. And how does it be used. And is it used or does it feel new? I could tell you one thing. That's a very compact little thing. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. But really what I'm trying to show you is the difference and the quality 
close up. As you can see, it has the nice lining of the UH MWDEXTYVBEEFFING. -E and my idiot ass thinks that goes there when it's really the swivel pulley that'll attach there. And it'll be nice and smooth and compact. Very high quality, I must say. That's why I'm looking at these uh, little wheels. I was very surprised at how small they were. But they actually, they're very beefy and um, sturdy compared to the Inspire, which is a lot larger. I would say, you know, 3.5, 2.5, whatever inches it, the difference is. But um, both of these handles that I have, the DIY surplus strength one and the dialed motion one are different because the surplus strength one is a lot heavier. That's because it's, you know, mostly fully encased with steel. While this is hollow. It still has a good knurling. It looks good, smells good, tastes good. I think it's all good. The difference isn't much. And there's not much more I could say here other than this is a great, great item. It's very, very small. The key to the locking mechanism, as you can see, kind of locks in like that. Let's lock in. Uh, ooh, my vagina! Put your dick in here. Patent pending, huh? Hmm. Lock, unlock. Flip of a switch. Dial motions proprietary. And What the fuck are those sounds? are beefy. Huh? 
you're feeling very likey now. You want to hit the like button. Hit the like button now. Yes, this was a little boring to show, but it's all good. The quality. It's all about the quality, the packaging, the materials, and I got to say it's A1. You know, it did cost a, a bit of change, but hey, I like it. Stay tuned for the next one.